Chinoy TV is brought to you by Oishi. Tonight on Chinoy TV, take a closer look on the life of the newly reigned Mr. Chinatown 2018, Moises Lim Yuan. Taste authentic and fine Cantonese flavors at Jasmine and take a peek into New World Makati Hotel's luxury suites. And as always, check out the latest happenings in the Chinese Filipino community. I'm Janine Chan, Washi Tai Shiren, and this is Chinoy TV, Feihua Dian Shi Tai. Resilience is all about being able to overcome the unexpected. Moises Lim Yuan did not expect to back the title of Mr. Chinatown 2018, but because of his determination to promote his advocacy, he was able to achieve his goal. Every boy would look up to his dad. His dad will always be his first hero. Basically, I saw my dad's kind heart becoming more charitable, more helpful, especially to the society. I am Moises Cleon Limiuen, Wo Jiao Lin Pei Chen. I am your Mr. Chinatown 2018, and this is my profile. Congratulations! Our Mr. Chinatown Philippines 2018 is. Candidate number six, Moises Lili Yuen. I took up marketing management. When I was in high school, I didn't know what to choose, so I just chose business courses. So I ended up with my course, but I actually enjoyed it found more friends, I became more interactive, I became more social, especially in my org. I joined this Filipino-Chinese org called Englicom. After college, I went into sales. So they told me like, everybody has to have experience at least once in their life in sales. And true enough, it made me more confident, it made me a better speaker, and it actually helped me a lot in my everyday life. So after that, I went to the family business. I think it's kind of expected for most Filipino Chinese to help out in their family business. So I went to construction with my dad. So I oversee projects and using what I learned in the corporate world, I implemented it to our family business. Aside from being a young businessman and promoting my advocacies for change and for nature, I joined Mr. and Miss Chinatown because I wanted to inspire more people, to make people become change makers themselves, to make them have their own advocacies, and to, to make the Philippines a nation of nation builders. So I'm really new to this. I'm really new to the pageant world, to modeling. So I had zero background in that. And basically it's a struggle for me to learn all these things. I didn't even know like how to smile properly. It's really competitive because I had all these good looking co-candidates beside me. They had all their different X factors, different talents, different personalities. So it's really competitive and I really wanted this not just for myself, but really to have a voice in this community. So during the coronation night, basically what we felt as a group is that, of course, there would always be fear. More than that, it's the fun of it. It's the fruit of the three-month journey, the, all the trainings we had together, all the camaraderie, and we enjoyed, we enjoyed a lot.
I actually didn't expect to be in the top 8. I tried to calm down. So I think that's one of the keys why I was able to answer really well. For the question and answer portion, I think I did well because I know why I am here in this journey. I know what I'm fighting for. So I just voice out what's inside of me. So I believe Filipino Chinese are crazy rich Asians because rich isn't only money. Rich is about culture, our diversity, and our heritage. Everything happened really fast. All these emotions like gushing into you. I didn't know if I w I'm gonna smile, if I'm gonna shout. The most memorable part isn't really the coronation night or winning this journey. It's the fact that for a span of three months, I got to know 27 other individuals and my co-candidates to be with them every day. And we formed a really good bond. We formed a family. During the pageant, I actually learned a lot. I learned to love my culture even more. I got to see the importance of it. And it got me thinking, if I won Mr. Chinatown, what would I do? And I thought that the first thing I would do is I want to give back, especially to public schools. I want to be an inspirational speaker to them. I want to have different classes in all these different schools, first in Manila. I deserve to be Mr. Chinatown because I have the heart to help. And everything I did and I will do in this journey is to give back to our community. I am Moises Cleon Lemuen, Wo Jiao Lin Pei Chen. I am your Mr. Chinatown 2018, and this is my profile. A coronation night is the most symbolic and most awaited event of any pageant. Chinoy TV is brought to you by. West Avenue Suites Blue Water Day Spa Oishi Nation for Complete Waterline UPVC Philippine Valve Manufacturing Company Albert Abaya Philippine Jinjiang Association Macron Trading Yokyan Garcia BA Securities, your trading partner in Asia Pacific.